To disassemble your Oberon Arc Flash suit hood, begin removing the components. Here goes the LED headlamp, which is an optional part. The strap is standard, Light the lamp is optional. Remove the fan from the back. Again, an optional component as an accessory. Just pulls out of there. On the inside, we have the hard hat, which is clicked in using these hard hat adapters. The hard hat adapters push out on each side. Some of these adapters are harder than others to get out. You could actually use a part of the adapter to push that out further. So I'm going to unscrew this nut off of the bolts. And this nut I'm going to use just to push the adapter out further. So then it's free. I'm being mindful not to scratch the inside of the shield with the front brim of the hard hat as I'm moving the parts around. Now the hard hat is out. We're going to continue with removing the adapters. These are the adapters that were holding the hard hat in place. They just pull out. We have a rubber washer. We have the shield stop, which is an angle part. There's the threaded bolt and the finger adapters. Remove that from both sides. and just keep them aside in one place. You don't lose them for when you need to reassemble the heart, the hood. At this point, I'm gonna remove this ventilation system. In the inside of every Oberon hood is a half zipper, and that's where the, this component is installed. The zipper runs the entire length around the inside of the hood. And I'm going to pull this hose out from the inside, pulling it through, placing it aside. The last part is to remove the shield, which I like to do inside out, placing the hood so that way the bottom is facing me. I start at the top, so I just pull the fabric around the top of the shield to free this part. There are snaps that are holding the lens inside. Unsnap those. And then there's a snap at the bottom. We unsnap that. We then put the shield aside. And we now have a fully disassembled Oberon Arc Flash suit hood. To reassemble the Oberon TCG series Arc Flash suit hood, we're going to start with the lens and the shell of the fabric itself. We're going to turn the shell inside out making this much easier for us. Have the hood so the bottom is in front of you. And then this pocket is where we're gonna put the lens. We just snap the first one in place. We then put the bottom of the shell or the shield into the fabric shell. At the top, we just pull the fabric over. There's actually a slit on the inside, which is where you pull this portion of the shield through. Do that on both sides. And then at the very top, there's snaps. We wanna make sure that this is secure in place. We connect the snaps from the hood shell to the shield. We can then turn the hood back around. So the black is the outside and the yellow is on the inside. On the inside of the hood, Oberon has a half zipper that runs the entire width around. We're gonna use that zipper to install a, an optional hood ventilation system at the back of the hood, there's a flap that runs top to bottom. And 
a corresponding porthole on the very outside. So at this point, we're going to push the FR hose through from the top down. And then we can use the back to find that coupling and to continue to pull it through. Still on the inside, we're going to find the zipper and connect them together. We need to completely zip in the hood ventilation system. Just pull that all the way around. Until we reach the very end. We can then, still working from the inside, we can connect our adapters. That will then allow us to install the hard hat. We want to make sure that we look at the adapters and find where it says left or right. This is our right hand side, which will click on the right hand side. And this is our left hand side. Shield stops are these angle pieces. They actually go onto the inside of the lens. At this point here. And then this part of the adapter will sit like this. We take our threaded bolt, we push it through until it's firmly in place. And then we take our rubber washer, push that onto the threaded bolt. We use our black nut to screw this down into place. We don't want to over tighten this. We just want it to be nice and firm and snug. If it's too tight, it's going to make your job to disassemble this much harder. So there's one side, and then we can repeat that process on the other side. Again, shield stop goes on the inside. If you look at the finger adapter, this bolt will seat in the hexagon shape here. We turn it around. Again, always on the inside, not on the outside. On the outside, we use the rubber washer, and then we use our nut to screw onto the bolt. You don't need any tools for this process. You should be able to use your hands and get a nice snug fit. At this point, we're going to just make some space inside of the hood so we can install a hard hat. Make sure the adapters fit the hard hat. You're not changing the hard hat because if the adapters don't fit, they will break. If your adapters break during this process, you should have replacements available. We line up each of these parts. Again, careful not to scratch the inside of our lens with the front brim of our hard hat. We just feel this part. It clicks into place. It's now locked in and secure. We're going to open up this suspension so it's easier to put onto our heads. At the back, we're going to install the ventilation system. We slide that fan unit into the strap. We then connect the coupling, just a little turn to get that locked into place. Don't over tighten it, otherwise you can break your little plastic parts. On the front, we have an accessory option, which is an LED headlamp. Depending if you want the button up or down is how you put this on. 